Hello, are you trying to install your Facebook pixel on BigCommerce and you're a little bit lost? I'm going to show you how easy it is. Um, so in this video, we're going to go over how to install that pixel on your BigCommerce store. Before we get started, my name is Cal. I'm a developer, a store owner just like you, and I run a community of store owners called e-commerce growth. I'll put a link at the end. Uh, if you want to join up with us and each week I post more e-commerce videos. So if you find this one helpful, subscribe and hit the bell and you can see even more. All right, let me share my screen and I'm going to walk you through how this happens. So if you log into your big commerce store and go to advanced settings and then data solutions right here, then it gives you a big page that looks like this currently. And you have an item here that says Facebook pixel connect. And then it says connect with Facebook Pixel. Now you used to have to actually find your Facebook Pixel number and put it in here, but they've made this really streamlined. So now you just have to log in as you and tell it which business manager you're connecting to, which Facebook this is, uh, which Facebook page this is pertinent to, uh, which Pixel you are trying to use. So in this case. I need to switch it off of my Epic Design Labs pixel and onto my Camper Light pixel because that's the store that I'm installing it on. So I would have picked the wrong pixel there. So this looks good. This is this is my business manager, Epic Design Labs. So you may not even have a business manager. It might just be blank in that in that case. Um, this is the page that's relevant. This is the correct pixel, Camper Light, Camper Light. Um, I'm just going to leave all that stuff standard click continue what is big commerce allowed to do manage your business yep um, access all these pages is uh, some of the instagram accounts that i have attached to this so i'm just going to say yes show a list of what i manage uh, which is camper light yep and all this stuff looks right so i'm just going to leave yes to all that stuff and click next <laughs> all right. Spinning, spinning, spinning. There we go. You're all set. Done. That is so much easier than it used to be. Let's see if it actually worked because I got kicked out of my business. I got kicked out of my big commerce account halfway through. So let's see if let's see if that worked all right it brought me right back to this page and here's what it should look like is it should show your pixel id and if you wanted to double check this you could log into your business manager or have your um, your ads person log into it and just confirm with you what the pixel id should be so this right here which ends in 0058 should match this ends in 0058 so we've successfully connected the Facebook pixel and data should start showing up in our pixeled audiences pretty soon. That's all there is to it. It couldn't be easier with the, with the new setup. But again, it wasn't always this way. It used to be much harder. Now it's just click, 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 click. Just make sure that it connects to the right page. And that's about it. All right. If you guys found this helpful, hit the like button and be sure to consider joining our community of uh, store owners, which is right up there. Join ecommercegrowth.com. If you need a developer for your store, you can hit me up at epicdesignlabs.com. And I'm always looking for new ways to help you guys out. This is all I've done for the last 10 years and I'm trying to give back. I'm trying to help you guys build million dollar stores. So whatever it is that you're stuck on, leave me a comment below and maybe that'll be my next video. Thank you so much and I will see you next time.